that your gut is going to be confiscated. This very day, a Syracuse merchant is apprehended for a rival group and not being able to buy it. According to the staff of the town, he dies in the very south of the west. Here's your money that I had to keep. Go bear to the centaur, where we host, and stay there, Dromeo, till I come to thee. For within this hour, it will be dinner time. Till that, I'll be the manners of this town, cruise the traders, gaze upon the buildings, and then return and rest within my men. For the long travel, I am stiff and weary. Give thee away. Many men are taking out your word, and go indeed, having so good me. A trusty villain, sir, that very oft, and when I dull with care and melancholy, lightens my humor with his merry jests. What? Wilt thou walk with me about the town and return to dine with me? I'm invited, sir, to certain merchants of whom I hope to make much, much benefit. Soon at five o'clock, please you, I will meet with you upon the mark, and afterwards consult you till bedtime. My present business calls me from you now. Very well, till then, I will go lose myself, walk up and down to view the city. Sir, I commend you to your own content. He that commends me to mine own content commends me to that thing that I cannot forget. For I to the world am like a drop of water that in the ocean seeks another drop. So I, to find a mother and a brother, and in doing so, unhappy, lose myself. Here comes the hell, and I quite should contend. How comes it that thou return so soon? Return so soon? Why the course too late? The king of the murderers. The pig falls to his fit. I struck a toll upon the bell. I used to escape one upon my cheek. She is all from his hold. Miss Colt, you come not home. To help me your way, sir. And tell me this, I pray. Where is the money I left with you? Oh, oh! Six pence that I had. Oh, when did I ask? The salad for Mrs. Crupper? The salad had, sir. I kept it not. I am not in a sportive humor now. Now tell me, and dally not, where is the money? We being strangers here. How darest thou entrust so great a charge on thine own custody? I pray you just to sit at dinner. I think my mistress can be the host. If I return, I should be close indeed. Sure, your fault on my case. Come, Dromeo, come. These just sort of season. Reserve them till a merrier hour than this. Where is the gold I gave in charge to thee? To me, sir? Why you the gold? Come on, sir knave. Have done your foolishness, and tell me how thou hast disposed thy charge. Uh, my charge was but to let you far. Hope your house the phoenix or dinner. My mistress and your sister stays for you. As I am a Christian, answer me. And where are the thousand marks thou hast of me? I have some marks you have upon my head. I saw my mistress once on my shoulder. Not a thousand marks between you both. What? Wilt thou flout me in the face, being forbid? Here, take thou that in that. What are you, sir? For God's sake, hold your hand. Nay, you must, sir. I'll take it my hand. By my life, by some device or other, the villainous or wrought of all my money. They say this town is full of cross and age. As nimble jugglers deceive the eyes, dark witch and sorcerers change the mind. If it proves so, I will be gone the sooner. I'll to the centaur to seek this slave. I greatly fear my money is not safe. 